I've got my minions working hard, as always. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to day two in Florida. We are heading to Miami Airport to pick up a hire car because we are traveling four hours up the coast to Orlando. So we've got our bags checked out at the Hotel Casa El Paseo. There's another video on our channel for that hotel. And we are going to grab the car and make our way up to Orlando. So let's go. bus stop to catch the 150 back to Miami airport station. Just gonna wait for the bus to come along in that direction. On a uh, side note, it's very warm. I've got the temperature on the screen here for you. It's obviously August, so just waiting for the bus to come along. Thankfully they have air conditioning. Free singles to the airport, please. That's it, back at where we started. We're gonna head up to the rental car on to the left there, Amy. Where? Oh yeah. Oh, no, left. Oh yeah. Look at that. Straight off the bus, straight to the rental car centre. Let's go and get a higher. What's that? Steamy glasses. Steamy glasses, Florida problems. To the rental car agency area where all the desks for the cars are. We think we're hurt, so we're going to check the paperwork and uh, have a look where that's over there. Yep. Yeah. So we're going to go get our car. So we've picked up the rental car, we've got space 252, we don't get to choose it, so we're seeing the car for the first time, just going to get it and go. Mrs. B was added on for free, so we're going to head down and we're going to pick up our car. We don't know what we're getting. But it's all part of the fun, so let's go grab the rental. So the rental car's on level three. Uh, Hertz is to the left. Amy, Hertz is to the left. 252, we're gonna head around and find a car in amongst all this. So the bays are on the floor, 233, 252. Probably this black one over here. Let's have a look. 240, 51, 49. Up oh, there we go. 252. We've got a Toyota Corolla Cross. Let's have a look. Give it a quick look around. Make sure it's all. It's just a standard small SUV. Just checking all the, if there's everything. All good, nice and clean, no dense sort of scratches. So let's get packed up and go. There we go. Still got a nice little big screen in it, though, isn't it? There we go. Let's get the car started. Where's the keys? You don't need to. You press the button. The keys are Oh, is it engine start? The quickie. Can you start it so that we can? That is ours in the rental car. We're going to head into Orlando. We've got a four hour drive. I've got no GoPro because I left on the train. Like a dumbass. So we're going to catch up with you and we get some breakfast because we are starving. No, you're starving. I'm not. You're not? 
I'm not. I've been drinking. Anyway, so let's get on to Orlando. I've not been drinking. I've been drinking juice just before everyone goes. So yeah, let's go to Orlando. So we've just stopped and kind of quickly grab a Burger King. It's just like quick and easy. And this is just literally a random Burger King in Miami on the way out. Got the sausage and egg melt meal, cheesy ham and egg breakfast melt meal as well without no egg for the little one. And Mrs. has got an egg normous burrito meal. French vanilla rice latte for myself, orange juice. What did you get? Minute Maid lemonade and what's that? Pink lemonade. Frozen pink lemonade. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, she got some chocolate chip cookies to try as well. I'll get you cookies in a second though. Ham and egg. Yeah. Whatever that was, I can't remember the melt. Yeah. Hash browns. There's your cookies. And this is my. Oh, look at that. comes with a little hash browns and Mrs B's enormous burrito again. She got that in the last series, didn't you? Yeah, it's yummy. So yeah, we're just going to eat this and get on the road. Burger King is always a good shout. $28 for those three meals and the drinks and the extra bits as well with the lemonade. We're going to literally jump in the car now for four hours, just drive straight to Orlando. So we'll catch up with you when we get to Orlando. Four hours of driving later, we've made it to Rosen in International. This is the Topsy Turvy Lounge and the Light Bite Restaurant. We're just checking in and getting our room. Well, like I say, we're back at Rosen International Drive, 7600. Checked in, we're going to go into our room. We're right opposite the pool in block 3000 and room 1460, which is. Okay. And that's the room view. As we go into room 1460. There we go. Lovely. We have done a room tour, a full room tour on the channel. I'll link the video in the corner. But uh, as you come in, literally two big massive beds, drawers, TV. And then Mrs. B needs a loo. Wee wee. Kitchen sink, bathroom sink, and microwave and a fridge. Nice and clean, tidy. Coffee maker on top, and through that door is a toilet and the shower. That's it. 
home for eight nights. Also, I forgot to mention, the park has two USBs on top with two plugs, and the lamp has two plugs on the side as well. Now, Leo's comfy. Yeah. Now we're going to Walmart. Now we're going to head out and, and nip to Walmart and get some food. Just come down to Dollar Tree on Turkey Lake, and they've already got signs for Halloween in August. So let's head into Dollar Tree. It's not a good sign, Mrs. B's already got a basket. I get a trolley. But it is Dollar Tree, so. I get a trolley. We ain't got no dollars. No, we don't need a trolley. Isn't it? It's just a trolley. Oh, right. Aww. Some awesome Halloween stuff. I oh, like a back of the chair cover, that's cool, for a dollar twenty-five. Pot holders, oven mitts. Oh, look at those. So much Halloween stuff. I've got some socks. I love these on the windows. Goblets with skeletons hand holding the cup. They're so cool. I bought a few of these a couple of years ago. A few of these chains. Loads of little signs. Oh, look at that one. That's proper retro Halloween. Loads of decorations for Halloween. We're only in August. Big bags of sweets for three fifty there. Yeah. And loads of decorations, crafty stuff. I'll tell you in America when you've got Halloween cards. These are like ceramic pumpkins, they're like $1.25, they're quite heavy. Like actual ceramics are it's quite, it's pretty good for a pretty good value. And then obviously all the usual Dollar Tree stuff. We'll show you some of that. What are you two looking at? I'll just get a pen. Oh we did a pen, don't we, for writing stuff, down. stuff making I left notes. My pen at home. Stationery. Got a metal sign there. Dad's workshop tool, my tools, my rules. And there's a uh, dad's fishing rules. That's cool. I pointed out last time in the last series, if you're going to stay in a villa, definitely come to Dollar Tree and get some toilet rolls. Dollar twenty-five for four rolls. One little thing you overlook when you're in a hotel. Kitchen rolls and everything as well, all dollar twenty-five. So one thing to remember if you're staying in the villa. We've also got like shampoo, conditioners and stuff if you needed any of that. Instead of bringing it, you don't have to, it's $1.25. Just come down to sweets and they've got all the sweets, all the individual packets. Do you want a charger? Yeah, all these individual sweets, like smaller packets. Instead of the Walmart massive ones. They also have the uh, singles to go in here for $1.25 each. Hawaiian Punch Blue Berry Blue Typhoon. Yum. Juicy Red. We've also got some individual Hawaiian Punch already made up. So like $1.25 for a bit of the bottle made. Biscuits, crackers and stuff. There's also a frozen section and a fridge section. Oh, look at those three dollar iced coffees. So that was the first Dollar Tree trip of this I did well, series. This is Beast only spent seventeen, eighteen dollars, which is very good for her on the first time. Gonna head round to Walmart now, which everyone loves to see, so I'll show you Walmart when we get there.
I love this place. So we come back down to the Turkey Lake Walmart, our favourite. Let's head in, check out some stuff in Walmart 2024. Two dollar Pringles. We've got so many different flavors. Home style ranch flavor, pizza, sweet potato, smoky barbecue. I've never seen that before. Hot honey. They look good. Oreos. All on rollback as well. Not bad at all. Individual pots of cereal. Got Lily had for breakfast this morning. Little pot of uh, Lucky Charms this morning. Nerds gummy clusters, these are absolutely awesome. I love these, they've got two different flavours. Oh, they're nerds, big chewies. They're cool. Hey, there's the other flavour, rainbow and very berry. 367 for the giant bag of how much the 226 gram bag. We will be taking some of these home with us, hamburger helpers, for like a dollar forty-eight deluxe. You make pasta and oh, add ground beef, and they've got macaroni cheeseburger. All these different, just literally make them from the packet, nice and easy. We're ready for the ranch? Anybody want some ranch? Can barely hold it. Only ten dollars twelve for that massive bottle of ranch. Giant pot of pickles. Love that. Sauces. Ooh, nice. So many sauces. Honey mustard. Can't beat it. Sweet baby rays. Oh, we've got no added sugar as well now. So many different sauces. Thought I'd lost them, they've gone down the cereal. Some little one wants some Lucky Charms for the room. Grab some Lucky Charms for the room and some milk for the fridge. They've gone all the way down there. Ghost. So Prime now one dollar eighty eight a bottle, and they've got the Glowberry for Halloween. I want to try that one? I haven't tried it before, but yeah, one dollar eighty eight now. All the hype's died off, I think. So all the crisp sizes are huge here. Taki's Bucking Ranch is a brand new flavour. The size of that, massive. The sauces and stuff to go with them, like ranch, uh, salsa and queso and stuff. Yeah, $2 for the potato chip sour cream, $2.24. They're not very practical, but if you just have them on the side, you can munch them. So these singles to go are actually cheaper here, $1.08 in Walmart. Big pots of lemonade, energy drinks. These are all like tipping your water, and ready to go. They have these um, squeezies, we call them, like concentrated. Just squeeze it into your juice, into your water bottle, sorry. Got sweet tea, lemonade, Kool Aid packets of 36 cents. These make up a big, like, two litre jug of Kool Aid. And then we've got all the Walmart shake. Yeah, look. Yeah, yeah. That's not bad at all. So I'm going to wrap up the Walmart part here. I'm going to catch up with you in some food. We're just going to grab it because we're getting hungry now.
Uh, we're gonna I'll pick up another Walmart video later on when we come back. So yeah, we're gonna wrap up the video for a Walmart here, and then we're gonna go get some food and we'll decide what we want. All these options, we don't know what we're having. So it's been decided. We are going to Checkers. Uh, yeah, no. yeah, we can go in this way. Yeah. Gonna grab some Checkers fries. Oh, I can't wait. Love Checkers fries. So this Checkers is literally across the road from Rosen Inn International. They've got one night in. Oh, apple pie. Let's go in and get some Checkers. Check is secure, we're gonna go grab something to eat now. I'll show you what we've got. We've got a bit of everything to share with you. And we've also got shopping. And we also done a thing with uh, a mobile phone. So we'll show you that when we get when we get around to it. See you in a sec. So we got big Burfords, both of us. I got the bacon barbecue. And Mrs. B got the original, I believe. Oh my god. It's cheese, bacon, barbecue sauce on the burger, fries. Portion of mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks. Some chicken tenders and some sauces to go with them. And then inside this bag here, a portion of funnel cake fries. Grab myself a Wendy's iced coffee, and we've pulled up outside. Five below. Let's have a look inside. Also, that checkers hit the spot massively. Let's have a look around five below. Some backpacks for back to school, five dollars. How good is that? What's that say? It says, I'm not rude, I'm honest. <laughs> Make it awkward. <laughs> Make it awkward. Little buttons and less honking, more tonking. <laughs> I love that. So these t shirts are five dollars fifty five, and you get all these different designs. What? I came, I saw there were people, so I left. I love that. I <laughs> and they've got like literally hundreds of t-shirt designs. It's so good. If you haven't been to a Five Below before, definitely come and check one out when you're in Orlando. So I haven't got much battery left on my phone and I forgot a <coughs> portable charger. You are... <laughs> Jesus, lower the tone of the video, why don't you, child? Well, we, we all do that. Yeah, we all do that, well. to be honest, but yeah. So I'll put some B-roll in of uh, Five Below with some of the cool things we find and then I'll get some charge on my phone and see what we're, we'll see where we're at later on. So the little ones just uh, come out of sweets and they've got lots of freeze dried stuff. Freeze dried, lemon freeze Oh wow. And they're all like five dollars. So freeze dried marshmallows. They're Skittles. Skittles, what we tried yesterday. They've got bigger ones as well. <clears throat> like even bigger ones. Oh wow. They've also got like pen and paper, but you can eat them. You can eat that pen and paper, that's weird. Uh, is that what you've got in your bar? Have you got that in your yeah. basket? Soul Patch Kids marshmallows. Ooh, that'd be interesting. Yeah. Only $4. Loads of different sweets that you don't get at home. They're awesome. <clears throat> oh my god. What? m m brittle brownies. Ooh, that'd be nice. Yeah. m m mega. Proper big sizes. They've also got like 
Ten sweets for a dollar twenty-five. So like you could basically like pick a mix up we used to have at home. So you can pick up ten little sweeties, that's cool. We've got loads of different ones, dum dums, starburst. And she's getting a little baggy for her friends. Frosted donut, Kit Kat. Snickers peanut brownie. Not seen them before. We've got just dark one, strawberry and dark chocolate there, mint and dark chocolate, cookie dough Twixes. That's cool. It's got Reese's cups with Reese's puffs on. So we've just found some ranch flavoured cotton candy. We're gonna just get Lil's reaction. No. Lil, we're gonna get you this. <laughs> so we just found some more freeze dried stuff. Ice cream Neapolitan sandwich, some beans, gummy bears, loads of different types, sour worms. So good. So good. And they're a lot cheaper than what we paid yesterday. Oh yeah. Oh, sunset's beautiful. So that is the end of day two in Florida. I nearly forgot then. Uh, yeah, we drove down from Miami International Airport with the rental car we got. Really nice car, actually, nice drive. And then we got back to Rosen Inn, 7600 International Drive. Can't wait to stay here again. Love the pool, love the area. Right smack bang on the International Drive just over there. Probably no, you can't see it from here. Um, yeah, so then we popped to Walmart, had a quick look around Walmart, grabbed a few essentials, and then we did uh, grab checkers as well. We didn't really show much because it was a drive in, but um, yeah, we had a really, really good day. Uh, however, the fuel on the car, we've just paid $22, I'll put it on the screen, um, for like three and a half hours worth of driving, like four hours of driving, so absolutely awesome. I'm going to end the video here, guys. If you liked the video, feel free to like, subscribe, and share.